For this November, there are a lot of local measures on the ballot, and today we're breaking down some of the school bond measures in Butte County. Action News Now reporter Blake Mayfield is live in Durham. So, Blake, what do families need to know about the bond measure for Paradise Unified School District? Well, Haley, much like the Durham Unified School District, the Paradise Unified School District has a measure on the ballot this November. That's Measure G. Now, Measure G is an initiative aiming to do upgrades on Paradise's current school facilities and equipment. And along with school upgrades, Paradise Unified is looking to actually rebuild an entire elementary school with the funds. Paradise Unified is asking for $43 million that they could spend until 2060, so it's a 35-year GO bond. And if you vote yes on this measure, it would increase your property taxes by $49 for every $100,000 in assessed value. Now that means if your property is worth $400,000, you'd be taxed an extra $196 a year by Paradise Unified's GO bond. And to assure funds are spent only as specified in the measure, Measure G requires the appointment of an independent citizens oversight committee, much like a lot of these measures, and the completion of annual financial and performance audits. And Measure G, much like the other measures that we've talked about, needs at least 55% of voters to say yes to pass on the ballot on November 5th. Reporting live in Durham, I'm Blake Mayfield, Action News Now. All right, thanks, Blake. And you can find the Your Vote, Your Future tab on our website for links to candidates and measure guides for all of the local counties.